Hey guys, this is Ryan from Wisdom Labs and I'm going to be telling you how to create a group product using the Wisdom group registration plugin. Uh, so as you can see, I am already on the edit, edit product page of a test product that I have created under WooCommerce products. And uh, once you scroll down, these are the settings you need to configure. You need to make sure that the product data is set to simple product. The virtual checkbox is checked. Uh, you associated uh, the courses that you need associated with this product. You go into inventory, make sure that the sold individually box is left unchecked. Scroll to the bottom of the page, you will see the enable group registration uh, checkbox. You check it and you a bunch of other settings will open up. Uh, the first setting allow users to check enable group registration on the front end allows uh, these potential group leaders uh, to essentially uh, select whether they want to purchase an individual uh, product or a group product. Uh, the ask group leader to pay for access will uh, essentially help uh, or give you the group leaders uh, an option to enroll themselves as well in the course uh, that is in that product. And uh, once this is left unchecked, uh, the group leader will essentially be auto enrolled in that course without having to pay for his or her seat. Uh, if this is checked, the group leader will obviously have to pay for their seat uh, as well. The unlimited members will uh, help the group leaders to purchase unlimited seats of that particular product. And uh, the bulk discount setting has another video altogether. Make sure you check that out as well. So all I'm going to do is hit update and then view the product on the front end. Okay, as you can see, I'm trying to view the product on the front end uh, of my site and uh, the WooCommerce product page will open up with all the settings that we had configured. Uh, there's an option to uh, make an individual purchase, a, a group purchase, enroll uh, the group leader himself in the particular product being purchased. Uh, I have a setting to uh, buy unlimited seats as well. So let's say I want to purchase 10 seats of the product. I have named this group Ryan Test. Uh, and this is what essentially the group will be named once it is uh, once it has been created on the back end. So what's going to happen is as soon as I make this purchase uh, or let's say as soon as I place this order, a group will be auto created in the back end uh, of your WordPress uh, with this user as the group leader who is making the purchase. So let's go ahead and check that out. So I'm quickly going to uh, place the order. I proceed to check out. I put in my details and I place the order. Okay, so once the order has been placed, uh, uh, the, the order goes into uh, the processing uh, status in the in the WordPress backend. The admin typically has to go to the backend and change the status from processing to completed. Uh, there is also an automated way to do this by downloading the autocomplete WooCommerce orders uh, plugin. Uh, you can download it from WordPress.org. Okay, so this is uh, my thank you page uh, for WooCommerce. And as you can see, our plugin uh, brings this proceed to group button over here using which uh, the group leader can directly enter the group's dashboard. So I'm gonna go uh, to the group's dashboard. Okay, so as you can see, uh, I am already the group leader of this group called Ryan Test. I can click on it and edit it and manage this group from here. As soon as I click on it, the group's dashboard will open up uh, where I can enroll new users, uh, create a group code for enrollees to enroll within this group, uh, the reports tab to check reports for my students and stuff like that. So there's another video that tells you all about how to use the group's dashboard. Make sure you check that out as well. Uh, if you have any questions regarding uh, how to create a group product, please uh, let us know on helpdesk at wisdomlabs.com and we'll be more than happy to help you out. Thank you guys.